everyone, it's Hayley. Hope you're doing really well. Um, I kind of wanted to... I'm really, really enjoying doing these videos on YouTube. Um, so I really wanted to kind of do... Rather than only doing TTC videos and waiting until there's something to update you all on and things like that, I thought I would kind of branch out and do some different things. So I'll be doing kind of like um, tags and... Um, hauls and a uh, day in the life of and outfit of the day and things like that and um, just because I'm really enjoying doing it so I figured I may as well do some fun stuff as well as just um, TTC so the one I'm going to do today is a birthday haul for Jacob's second birthday um, his birthday is on the 25th of May which is a week Sunday um, and I've now finished buying, or we've now finished buying all of his gifts. So, um, we've kind of just been picking them up since after Christmas. If we've seen anything when we've been out and about, we'll just pick something up. So, it's going to seem like we've just gone absolutely mental and really like, over spoil him. But it's just because we've kind of gradually picked things up as we've seen them. So, um, also, I've got one three gifts for him which were from an NCT sale um, so I don't know if you guys know about NCT sales but basically they're nearly new sales and they're run by the charity um, NCT um, and the three items that we got from there were absolute bargain bargains and they're in brilliant condition they look brand new so um, we bought them and he has so many toys and it had just been Christmas so we didn't want to give them to him then so we figured oh, we'll just keep it until his birthday so there are three items that I've bought from there but I'll show you that in a minute so first of all I'll show you the gift wrap and the card that we've got so we've always planned um, because last year for his first birthday we did like a bumblebee theme um, and it was kind of based on the hive um, and um, he didn't ever really, when he was very young um, I used to put the TV on when he had his morning bottle and then the TV would go off and that would be it now he only ever watches TV for sort of an hour before we go upstairs for a bath and bed maybe not even an hour, maybe half an hour um, but the one programme that really sparked his interest was The Hive, which is on the Disney Channel, and it's Bumblebees. Excuse me. Um, so, uh, and then soon after that, he kind of started to get into kind of what I call the big boys things, like Mickey Mouse and Jake and the Neverland Pirates and things like that. So, we would always kind of assumed that we were going to do a Jake and the Neverland Pirates themed birthday party for his second birthday. Um, also because he's got loads of pirate books he's a massive, massive book fan um, he, loves re he loves us reading stories to him he likes to read himself he, he loves books and he's got quite a few that are pirate themed so we always kind of thought that we would do that however in the last sort of six months he's really and I mean we never if he ever watches the TV he watches Disney Channel we never watch any other kids TV programmes and all of a sudden, just out of nowhere, he developed a love for Thomas the Tank Engine. So I don't know if it's something that's happened at nursery, like they've got Thomas toys or something like that. But we were in Asda a couple of months ago, and we were walking past the birthday cake section. So I picked up a Jake cake and a Thomas cake, and he picked the Thomas cake, so that's where the theme of his birthday has come from. So, with that in mind, the wrapping paper is... Thomas the Tank Engine, and I bought two rolls of that, and that was two, they were two pound each. Um, then I got this pack of gift, uh, not gift tags. No, there's no gift tags in there. Bows and ribbon. Um, they were that was two pound for the pack, and then we got him this sun. Thomas card. They didn't have any um, t 
to our son on your second birthday, Thomas cards. So we kind of figured it was more important for the son one. But I'm very much into words and I know he's only two and he doesn't really know any different. But there's nothing in there. So I may buy a separate one for, you know, our son on your second birthday. And he'll have two. Um, so the gifts. I'll do the NCT ones first. Uh, I say that, but one of them is absolutely massive. Um, he's developed a real keen interest in anything transport. So his new bedroom um, furnishings is all transport related. So we saw this at the NCT sale. And it's a massive early learning centre garage. And that cost us the grand total of £3. And that was for the garage and all the car accessories and everything. So that was a massive bargain. And then the second one is these ones from the book people are £25. And I think we got this for 8 But it's the Thomas and Friends Story Library, which has got 50 books in it. He loves reading and he loves trains. So that was perfect. And then the last one we got there, um, he was at, um, I got his, picked him up from nursery one day and they give him, they give me forms to say what he's eaten, when he slept, what his nappy, you know, whether he had wet or dirty nappies, um, and what he's played with. And they, one day they sent him home and they said he'd been playing with Clippo and I was like, I have absolutely no idea what Clippo is. But it's basically like stickle bricks, if you remember stickle bricks from when we were all younger. Um, so we bought him a tub of Clippo. So then, um, we, he got, ooh, making noise, he got um, like a Magna Doodle type thing. Um, when we went to see Santa Claus at Christmas but he was <laughs> probably a bit too young for it and um, stood on it and broke it so we bought him a new one which is from Asda and I think it was £6 so he's got that um, then we were, we were in the Disney store in Leicester a few weekends ago um, we had gone away for the weekend and I bought him a new lunchbox and flask Mickey Mouse. I thought they were quite cute. So his sandwiches getting squashed in in his bag. Um, then I said earlier that he likes Jake and the Neverland Pirates and we were in buying him shoes for a wedding we've got soon and um, he went crazy over these Jake sunglasses and they were 4 99 and they were from Dykeman um, so yeah he went crazy over those sunglasses and we thought well there's no point in giving them to him now because it's not really that kind of weather so we've waited until his birthday and then this, I can't remember how much this was. It's from Boots. And it's a little tractor puzzle. He absolutely loves puzzles, so I know he's going to love that. Um, okay, that's it from that side. Then, to add to the ridiculous amount of books that our two, nearly two-year-old has, um, I picked up this Mr Birthday and we bought Mrs Birthday for our niece whose first birthday it was in March so we've got Mr Birthday for Jacob and then he absolutely loves all of the Julia Donaldson books absolutely loves them so this one he doesn't have and he loves farm animals so I think that's a squash and a squeeze and then Suddenly, I think because of his little cousin who loves Peppa Pig and she's got all Peppa Pig toys, Jacob's decided he really loves Peppa Pig. So I bought him the Happy Birthday Peppa book. This is uh, these two books, and the next thing I'm going to show you, I bought after me and my husband had said no more. <laughs> I can't. 
I can't help it. If I see something that I know he'll love, I have to get it. <laughs> um, and then this was the other one. Lego Duplo. Um, and it's like a farmyard kind of set. And then the last thing, which is his main present. And I wanted him to have it last year, but my husband was thinking that he was probably too young for it. So we didn't go for that in the end. Um, but it's a sand and water table and it was £15 from Asda so uh, we were looking at one from Argos and it was £45 and I was in Asda with Jacob a few weeks ago I saw it and I thought there's not actually much difference between the two so we went for the, the cheaper one so I'm sure we're going to have a very, excuse me, a very, very excited uh, little boy when he's opening all of those presents. And I might do um, a haul of the presents we got bought for him as well um, after his birthday, which is week Sunday, so it won't be for a little while. But yeah, so that's it. I think we probably went a little bit OTT, but... When you start buying things early on, you forget what you've already bought until you pull it all out of the cupboard and then you realise we probably did a bit too much. But um, he'll love them all and everything, so that's all that matters. But yeah, so that's the end of my little man's second birthday haul. Um, I'll probably do another quick video just to show you all the decorations. We ordered them from Parties R Us and they've not arrived yet, so... Um, but that was a big um, set for £20, I think it was. So, um, yeah, I'll probably just do a quick video to show you the party bits um, and the stuff that we buy for the party bags and things like that. Um, yeah, and I'll speak to you again soon when I do either my next TTC update or one of my next fun videos. But I hope you're all well and I look forward to talking to you all again soon. Take care guys, bye.